Now I've got with me the Honeywell Gas Alert Max XT2 for gas detector. This is a clip-on diffuser monitor for continuous use, or it can be used as a sample pump monitor for your pre-entry testing. If you've ever worked in a trade that requires you to enter a confined space, you've either seen someone conduct a pre-entry test or you've done it yourself. Here's something important that I want you to be aware of. If your test only took a handful of seconds from start to finish, well, you didn't do it right. As a rule of thumb, it takes two to three seconds for air to travel one foot through the hose. By this math, with a 10 foot hose, it's gonna take 30 seconds before any air hits the sensor. Once that air has passed the sensor, it'll take another 30 seconds for the sensor to register a reading. That's a minimum of one minute total. And just when you thought you were done, there's more. You see different gases, they sit at different levels, which means you'll need to conduct multiple tests at different heights to test for these gases. OSHA recommends doing one test every four feet. So to do the math for you, if you have a 10 foot drop, you're gonna to need to conduct three individual tests. And by extension, three minutes of testing to get it all done. So no, counting to 10 is not gonna cut it, not to do it right. And we're all about doing it right here at Power Pack and we wanna help you do the same. 